Hello YouTube and welcome to my channel and my new video. Before we start, remember to click the subscribe button and the notifications bell for more of my future content. Okay, so today I'm going to be going into more detail of the British Army's new soldier conditioning review. This is what every phase 3 soldier will complete as of the 1st of April 2019. So the PFA scrapped, PEZ is coming in for GCC, so ground close combat troops, non-GCC, We'll be doing the AFT still, the 8 mile tab, but every phase 3 soldier will be doing the soldier conditioning review. Okay, and this is the broad jump, the med ball throw, hex bar deadlift, a 100 meter sprint, heaves, and a 2 kilometer best effort. If you are joining the army and you're going through selection or basic training, you'll do the roll fitness test. Uh, the, I do have some information on that, so the information I do have I will pass on in a future video over the next week or two, but today I'm just covering the soldier conditioning review. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you a demonstration of each of the exercise and just explain a little bit more about it and why we are doing it. So we're going to go into that now. The med ball throw, this is to test your upper body explosive strength. All you're going to do is sit against the wall with your legs out in front of you straight. You're going to pick up the medicine ball and then with your back straight against the wall, elbows against the wall, you're just going to thrust forwards as far as you can, throwing the ball forward without using any extra momentum from your shoulders, back or arms. The next exercise is the broad jump. Okay, this is a double footed jump from point A to point B to test your lower limb explosive strength. Like I said, it's a double footed jump from one line. You're going to jump as far forward as you can landing double footed again from point A to point B and then there measure the distance. The next test then is the hex bar deadlift. This is to test your lower limb strength. What you're going to do is just one max rep, lift the weight up and then there are keep increasing it and see what weight you can lift with the hex bar. Next is your 100 meter sprint. This is a 5 by 20 meter sprint. Okay, so they're going to measure point A to point B 20 meters. You're going to sprint 20 meters, sprint back, sprint 20 meters, sprint back, sprint 20 meters, okay, until you've done a total distance of 100 meters. Then you've got the heaves. This is to test your upper body strength. This is from a dead drop, okay, you need your arms fully extended. Then it's all the way up to your chin above the bar. Hold, for, pause for a second, back down, pause for a second, back up, pause for a second, back down, pause for a second, okay. This is as many as you can do within two minutes. You have a best effort two kilometer run, okay? A bit like the mile and a half in a PFA, but this time it's a two kilometer run. Best effort as fast as you can, get round there. So for each of the exercises, there have been standards set, so you have to get in between a minimum and a maximum score. I don't have the scores, but not don't worry too much. Just keep training, keep practicing and I'm sure you'll get in between the minimum and maximum. If you don't, the whole point of the test is to let you know where you're at. So if you're below the minimum or close to the minimum, they'll say, look, this is what you need to work on. If you're by the maximum, they'll say, look, we're happy with this. You, you, you know, you don't need to progress any further, but just keep doing what you're doing. But with the heaves, there is no standard set as of yet. So just do as many heaves as you can. If you do one, then yeah, okay, if you do 10, then yeah, okay, there is no standard set as of yet. They're going to test it for 12 months, see how it goes, and then they'll put a standard in. So there's the soldier condition review. Like I said, that's for all phase 3 soldiers as of the 1st of April. Hope you liked the video. If you did, remember to click the subscribe button and the notification bell for more of my future content. And I'll catch you in a bit, guys.